Welcome to Open House! What's up everybody? My name is Mallory. I'm a first year student here at the vet school and today we're going to talk about lungs and you're probably wondering what this is behind me and if you guessed the Shetland pony, you're correct. So the lungs on this pony, they're going to sit in the rib cage. You'll have the right lung sitting on the right rib cage side, the left lung sitting on the left. So horses only breathe through their nose so whenever they take a deep breath in, it's going to come and expand the lungs and fill up this rib cage and whenever it exhales, it's gonna take a deep breath out and then they're gonna go back to where the normal size is. So now let's go over it and see what real lungs look like. Hi, my name is Allison. I'm a first year student here at the vet school. Hey, I'm Sam. I'm also a first year student here at the vet school. So as you can see, this is a pair of horse lungs. Um, this horse was humanely euthanized for a number of health reasons. You can even see here some of the damaged parts of the lungs here, They're a little bit darker and a little bit bumpy and you've got some healthier tissue. Um, under this side, we had a lung that was a little bit more damaged, so I am holding it off so that this one can blow up a little bigger for you. We have it slowly breathing right now, so you can kind of see a little bit of it. We're going to crank it up later so you can really see how well they expand. Horses' lungs can carry about 50 to 66 liters. So if you imagine when you go to the store and you buy that two liter bottle of Coke, it's about 30 of those that'll fit into this lung. So as we can see here, this is the trachea. So this is whenever you breathe in, this is how the air gets down into your lungs. So we have a right lung, and a left lung. And as you breathe in, the lungs will expand and fill with oxygen, and that oxygen will go into your blood. And then once you exhale, they will deflate and travel out and bring the carbon dioxide out. So if you wanna put your hands on your rib cage and breathe in deep, and you can feel your lungs expand and fill with oxygen, and then exhale and feel them compress and release. So now we're gonna watch how the horse lungs can expand and deflate. Next, we have an activity um, where you can see how your lungs expand and deflate. Hello, everyone. My name is Vivi, and I'm a first year veterinary student here at um, LSU SVM, and I'm here to show you a really cool activity you can do at home. So, earlier we talked about the lungs, so these are also horse lungs, and I want to show you just down right here is where this really big muscle called the diaphragm sits. Now, when we exhale, the diaphragm is relaxed and it will sit right up in here and it creates this negative pressure, almost like a vacuum. So when you inhale, the diaphragm pulls down this way and this pulls um, air into the lungs with that negative pressure that we talked about that was in the chest cavity. So you can actually demonstrate this in a really cool experiment at home using just two balloons and a plastic bottle. So this Balloon inside here is what represents the lungs, and this balloon down here is gonna be the diaphragm. So when our diaphragm contracts and pulls down, the negative pressure inside the bottle is gonna pull air into our lungs. And you can kind of see it inflate just a little bit right there. So let's see if you can make this at home. Good luck. Thank you for coming to our virtual presentation. We hope to see you guys next year um, when it's not COVID time. But uh, as for now, hope you guys had a fun time. You learned a lot from us. Stay safe. Bye. Thanks.